Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another thrifting video. So I'm here at Goodwill and I'm gonna take you inside and see if I can find anything. I'll show you what I get at the end of the video. I probably will stop into one other thrift store on my way home and I will show you any of that footage as well. All right, so let's go thrifting. So if you're new to my channel, you may not know, but I actually have a daughter named Hannah, and it was really neat to see her name spelled out in this artwork. And then it was really funny to see these random fake bananas, because like most girls named Hannah, she did get the nickname Hannah Banana. This next item I wanted to share with you I thought was pretty unique. It was a music box lamp. And here is what it sounds like. And I thought it was a pretty unique score for only $7.99. I really liked this globe bookend but there was only one and the paper around the globe was starting to come off so I did leave it behind. So I have left Goodwill and now I'm in my second stop for the day. So let me show you a little bit of footage and then I will show you what I purchased at the end of the video. So I actually have a sewing machine very similar to this one here. Mine was a little bit older. I think it dated back to like 1906. I only paid $25 for mine and I absolutely love it. So the only thing that I found at Goodwill was this planner and it was brand new. It still had the protective plastic covering on it. So this planner is actually leather and it's from a company called Little More and they are planners designed with the minimalist in mind. There was no price on it so the cashier just charged me what they would charge for a soft back book which was only 69 cents. And these actually retail for about $20 on Amazon. So the next thing I found was at the second thrift store and it was these lovely turquoise mugs here. And these were only 99 cents each and they happen to be Fiesta Wear. I absolutely loved the design of these and the color and there happened to be 10 of them and they were in excellent condition. So I grabbed all 10. I will definitely keep some of these for myself and then I'll probably end up giving some of these away as a gift. So that is all that I found on this particular thrifting trip. I hope this video gives you some inspiration to go out and thrift for yourself because you never know what you're gonna find. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope to see you back for many more thrifting adventures and I'll see you in the next video.